Hello everyone, this is Ranger Rob from the Ranger Rob Country Living. And they're making some headway in our house. So you guys know we're having new siding put on. And uh, so everything's been a wreck. But they actually got one end of the house done. I thought we'd take a look. All right guys, so this is the chaos going on. But you can now see what the new siding is going to look like. So let me come around here so the sun's in the right area. And you can see that's uh what's the name of the siding again? Hardy Plank. Yeah, it's called Hardy Plank. It's actually a concrete, I guess. So uh, you get it installed and they seal it. Uh, they've been they're putting the trim on and uh, it looks pretty cool. But a lot of chaos right now. Oh yeah, we did have a Another problem here is right here, they had to disconnect this from the, the house so they could put the hardy plank on. And uh, turns out it was my sump pump. So we had this out for a couple of days and the toilet stopped working. Anyway, they got it hooked up again. And uh, <laughs> all is well. So, uh, and they've started this side here. And it, uh, it's coming along. So yeah, it's going to be really good, but you got to be patient because you know, your yard's going to be all torn up for a while. But uh, the guys are nice. They know I'm going to be filming and being understanding. And they're checking in with me to make sure because we've been shutting off power and stuff like that and causing havoc with my computers and stuff. But all is well. And it's going to be beautiful when it's done. So Okay, I'm back. So uh, a little bit of craziness going on but in a good way so our life here is going to be turmoil because as the pounding on the house and the new siding is going on uh something i realized so <laughs> i trying to make this house uh self-sustaining in the event that we don't have power or something not over the top i don't need to power the whole house and what kind of convinced us to uh to uh do that is when our sump pump went out so we got a septic system never thought about that but uh it took about three days before we realized the sump pump wasn't working so that means in a grid down situation uh our toilets would only work for three days so uh, we found out it's on a 20 amp service. So when we shut the power off on here, we didn't, uh, and he unhooked it, uh, didn't realize what was happening. So that means I want to back up this house on uh, my 20 amp circuits, at least, um, with another bypass system like I did with the well. If we go back in our older videos, you'll see that we did the well house here with a backup system that we could plug a generator in so we have water. And I'm happy about that. But now we have a pellet stove and then we have the sump pump, which we never thought about, that we want to be able to power up when we want to. So I contacted the same electrician who did my well house and we're going to put in another jumper system to bypass four different circuits that are uh, no more than 30 amps which happens to cover the ones I want to cover would be the ones where my pellet stove is uh, a place where we can keep our fish alive and making sure that we have power to our uh, sub pump and then uh, all right. so next week that guy's coming in and he'll work on that and then I got the siding being done and then to add on to that these guys also do extra jobs for us so we're going to hire them to put stairs in the shop here because this shop has a, uh, a loft up above here that the only way you can get to is a ladder at our age we don't want to be using ladders and there's a lot of stuff up there so we're going to have them build a staircase to go up there. And then in two weeks, we have a lot of the equipment that's in here 
uh, we sold to uh, family members and they're gonna come pick that up so there's a lot of chaos so uh, anyway once again uh, so being self-sufficient being prepared um, could I last a long long time off the grid probably not could I last weeks easy a month we could get by more than a month it'd be rough but we could do it um, like I said I, I like to have a <laughs> I want a plan of what you know a half up to six months to a year that'll get us pretty damn close when it comes to hot water by the way I have a fifth wheel we can use that um, for creating hot water and taking showers if we're in a grid down situation so that's the plan and I'm sticking to it so I want to thank you guys for listening today and a little bit of chaotic uh, video uh, lots of things going on and uh, we'll try to keep you up on all the latest changes we got nine eggs today by the way so we're averaging nine up to ten eggs a day so we're pretty cool about that so I want to thank you very much for listening please take the time to like really share our videos really helps us um, and uh, <laughs> subscribe we'd really appreciate it so guys have a great day thanks for watching bye now our videos are made possible by Ranger Rob poopy bags available at Amazon right now thank you very much for watching our video please take the time to like subscribe and share our videos all over the whole wide world thanks